Thank you. Good morning, everybody in the room. I won't mention anybody specifically, so now it's better, I hope. Yeah? Okay, good. Now, the one and only person I would like to point out is welcome Christoph. Christoph to the MCTS. The Institute for Ethics in AI is our new kid on the block. So that's uh, the most recent arrival in a way. And this is my one and only chance maybe to introduce the MCTS to you in order to, for you to know what MCTS is about. Actually, we are talking about MCTS 2.0, meanwhile. It's all about promoting and shaping the general idea of human-centered engineering at TUM and, of course, beyond, if possible. So what does this mean? TUM is, of course, already known for technical excellence. It's already known for entrepreneurship. But now comes something special, namely responsible research and innovation. Wow, that's something to go for. I hope you will uh, uh, like it. So what do we want? It, the MCTS is a center with a so-called transdepartmental function that is an integrative research center. We convene scholars from the humanities and the social sciences as well as from engineering natural sciences. What type of research is done here? It's always strictly empirical. It's interdisciplinary, it's dialogic. Of course, I know everybody said that, but we mean it, that's for sure. So what is our mission more precisely? Please, and this are um, very bold sentences. Let's not separate technology and society anymore. Let's rather see how technology and society are intertwined all the way through from the agenda setting to its research to its effects afterwards. Let's see how ethical, social, political, legal, whatever issues are part and parcel of each and any technology. So let's not wait for artifacts and algorithms being built and only then ask for ethical issues or for ethical or acceptance. Let's rather cooperate right from the start social sciences, humanities, engineering, natural sciences, whoever has a stake in the particular research, let's go together right from the start. So why should that happen at the MCTS? Because it's just the right platform. It's a platform to conduct interdisciplinary research with practical applications and in strict cooperation with either industry and or civil society, whatever is entailed. And also, we are united, I think, in the very idea that scientific technological advancements and societal developments are always closely interrelated, impact each other continuously, and in ever more ways, highly dynamic. So this is what integrative research on technology and society is about at MCTS. It is about integrative research projects. It's about doctoral training for all faculties involved. It's all about public engagement. And by implication, this holds for the new center, the new institute as well. And if we now zoom in on no, AI in society, I don't need to tell you much. We've just heard it again. AI is accompanied by a bunch of urgent social, political, and normative issues. Here are some of them, but only a few. So this uh, is accompanied by an urgent need for independent research on, for instance, possibilities and limits of AI development, for the necessary and sensible regulatory measures and many other things. How should we do it? Of course, I think you know it by now, by heart, interdisciplinary research, including the social sciences, including the humanities, and a clear commitment to the inclusion of different, of critical, of challenging expertise. This is important, bring it in right away. And this is what we call responsible research and innovation in AI. Next to our integrative research projects, I think Christoph will mention them right after me, we intend to do a bit more, go for the juniors, junior research groups, go for embedded innovation partnership, go for flagship conferences, always convening experts from various fields. That'll help to really go for the issue to go into the dialogue. 
when it comes to dialogue, here we think of high-level responsibility talks, if you want to call it, for, for instance, open science labs, or else responsibility in entrepreneurship. Let's go for different talks in different fields that might help to spread the word. There is a way to go for responsible research and innovation in AI. Indeed, this is what we want, and we hope that our new institute will act as a role model for interdisciplinary integrative research and help establish the vision of human-centered engineering at TUM. So welcome, a warm welcome to you, Crystal, to the new institute. Let's go and work together. Thank you.